hey there guys and ghouls strange little tart here and I know normally I try and give you guys this little uh, intro when we're at the beginning of the game however this particular game Ebola doesn't allow me to adjust the sound settings at the beginning menu and it is blowing my eardrums out so I figured I'd save you guys a little bit of the pain and troubles there and just go ahead and uh, you know start us here in this nice little peaceful save room which you'll see later on in the video but you know for now I hope you guys enjoy. I'm not gonna lie to you. I got confused. You'll see. Don't worry about it. You'll you'll see. Just wait for it. All right, and let's get started. There we go. Little. All right. Look, there's a lot of open areas, and I don't like any part of this. Why are we in a sewer? These are very large sewers. What's going on down here? What is all of this? Legit. Short course cracker locks. In order to start hacking the lock, you need to open the backpack by pressing. Ah, oh, crap. Okay. All right. I and then E to interact. Mouse and the X button. Okay, fantastic. Okay. Alright, so we need to go into our backpack. Dude, this is some serious seriousness. You had me open that? Okay, I was about to say, you had me open that whole thing and then you didn't even like give me. Oh, there's a dead body in there. I don't like any part of that. Um, um, you, there. That child don't fucking learn to stop stomping around this house while I'm playing scary games. I'm on die. There's a lot of blood in here. Why is, why is there so much blood in a dead body? I don't like it. What? What? Uh -uh. Okay, I can aim. God, I got old guy hands. <sighs> From one to four floors, the situation is out of control. The virus, E, as it was called by scientists, escaped from the lab area. <laughs> oh, fantastic. As a security representative, I don't know what to do. According to the protocol, the situation was not foreseen. The protective computer mechanism did not work. The contamination zones were not isolated, and they themselves were destroyed by fire. Employees were not evacuated at the time of the accident. I was on the ninth floor because of this. I probably didn't go crazy like most other employees. There was complete confusion and panic. The entire security department was disturbed, distributed to all floors to take control of the situation. People began to go crazy. My partner and I went to patrol the floor and withdraw the staff, but all in vain. He became inadequate, became infected. I could not save him in time. Pounced on me. He bit off my hand. He bit off your whole hand in one bite. He bit off his hand in one bite. How you gonna bite off his whole hand in one bite? How? Just how? To hell with the orders. What is this if not punishment from heaven? I feel strong weakness, bleeding from the nose. The whole body burns. Soon I will become a damn beast, but this will not happen. I'd rather die a man than be a crazy monster. Anyone who reads this, note, save yourselves. Survive and tell people what happened here. Do not give this damn contagion. Not clear from the blood. Oh, isn't that like... It's real dark. It's real dark in here. Um, super dark in here. Hey, buddy! Did you... You, you didn't happen to leave any other, um... You know, bullets or anything lounging about? Yes. 
That's not bullets for my thing, is it? Hey, man, why is it so creepy in here? Like, I get it. It's a sewer and shit, but... Oh, God, there's so many open ways I could get attacked. That's where I came from. There's a dead body in there. I don't know. Okay, I know there's a door there, but, like, I'm compelled to check other places. Ooh, I don't like where my compulsions are leading me. I'm not a fan of what what I'm thinking of doing. This is a bad idea. You ever you ever thought that and then just kept kept going with your bad ideas? It is a bad idea. You know it's a bad idea, but yet you keep doing it. This is such a bad idea. Um. Hey, you know what giant red doors mean? Red doors mean bad. Ideas. Oh, are we now? Okay, look. Here's a padlock. Let's not deal with any of these uh, sneaky, sneaky peats around corners and stuff. Pretty sure I'm making a lot of noise by running. Okay, it's just fans. These are these are lights. All right, it's not scary. I'm not scared. You're scared. Fine, it's fine. That's where I came from. That's where the dead body is. Which means I need to go around here. I don't trust this door. But I'm also sure if we don't trust any of it. That's a door. And uh great, it's three doors. Okay, yeah, I I don't trust any of you. You ever you ever been told that in your life? I don't trust any of you doors. We'll go systematically left to right. Back it up. Fuck this shit. I don't, I don't hear anybody. If y'all hear that noise though, right? It's not just me, that noise. Alright, where are we going? I better not get fucked over by this room. Who's standing in there? Who's standing in this fucking room? Nobody. Okay, can I close the door? Can I close the door so no oh, I can close the doors? Okay, nobody. Can somebody else open the door though? Can I still open the door to get out? I got a lot of questions, not a lot of answers. Oh god, that's scary. Okay, um, what we got going on here? Secret. Due to the unstable situation associated with the E-Virus on the base of the Mole 529, the order number 928, I'm never going to remember these numbers, was received from the... Okay, what is that big-ass word? I have no idea what that big-ass word is. Okay. I just... Oh. So the command immediate, I'm going to assume that one word was supposed to be two, but you know what, we'll let that slide. Alright, the order number 928 was received from the command immediate evacuation of the following employees. One, employees of the Office of Security Systems, A, Adam Davis, the sequence number for the employee is 59B, Chris Johnson, blah 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 blah, these are just people we're supposed to grab out. Well, you know what, fuck those guys. Um... Can I just go ahead and say, like, point blank, I don't actually want to open this door? I'm very scared about what could come out of the doors. Because I don't like them. You know, you know me? No, you know me. Alright, let's see. Alright, back up. Back up, we don't know what's coming. We don't know what's in these rooms. I don't, I don't trust anything about any of these rooms. Oh, this is a this is a nice room. It's a nicer room than what I was expecting. I'm gonna close the door. Don't trust any of this shit. Okay, that's bad cabinet placement. Yeah. 
What is this? Is this a med kit? Absolutely. I want this. What is this? What's all of this? To save the game to the bed, go to the inventory by pressing uh, and clicking on the dream catcher in the inventory. Close the inventory and press E on the bed. What would you have not what would you not have killed? Close the door before going to bed. Well, yeah, definitely close the door before you go to bed. That's the whole point. Oh, oh, oh. Nine millimeter, nine millimeter. Uh, yes, on this. I'm supposed to do this and press E to go to bed. And I closed the door already. So we've at least made it this far and we have a gun. I'm very worried still that, you know, we're going to wake up. The game is safe. But now I'm very worried about a gun. I'm very worried I'm going to open this. There's going to be people on the other side. I can kick? Oh, 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 you Ebola victims, watch out. I can kick. I don't trust it. I don't trust it. Is that blood on the ground? You guys see that? You don't think that's blood on the ground? You know what? I'm gonna close this door because I don't want nobody getting in on my shit. Alright, we're gonna try this one last door. Be backing up though. I don't trust. Especially don't trust it with that fucking sound effects. Is that somebody standing there or is that the bed frame? Uh-uh. No, 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 no. I closed that door. I closed that door. Uh, no. Fuck you guys. Trust me. Uh, viral outbreaks and contagions, I'm very cautious. Very, very cautious about keeping my doors open. Like, I just, I don't want to keep doors open during uh, viral outbreaks and stuff. Okay, uh, ordered our team to disguise the entire ninth floor under the sewage system. So we're on the ninth floor right now. 50 meter layer. Okay, look. I just need to know if one of these pages has that little little number that, that we need. Okay, so we're not infected. We've got two antiviruses. So we've got two med kits. Um we got two antiviruses. We got a bucket of bullets and a gun. So, alright, so, I don't remember all the numbers for all of this, and that's worrisome, but the good news is, is that door's open, maybe it's not good news, I don't know, I don't see anybody, but there's a safe right there that I didn't notice before. We're gonna close this. What's the deal with the- why? Why the creepy noise all over again? Can't mess with the computer. Pen. Alright. I gotta, I gotta write something down because like god damn there's a lot of numbers there. And I feel like I'm gonna write them down and I'm still gonna miss it. So let's see. I got four, two, three, three. But I don't think that's the right one. But it's the only one that I see that's got four numbers. Hmm. Four, two, three, three is the only one that's got four numbers to it, which I think might be the only way to get in down to the the one area that's got that thing the door that we're gonna go to 
We're not gonna be scared. You know, the red light door. The TLC door. The red light special. I beg your pardon, sewers. Is this really an appropriate sound that you need to have? Guys, isn't it bad enough that you got the creepy door? Do you really need to do that? Mary? Alright, uh, it does start with four. We're going to... Oh, it does. Okay. Maybe that wasn't it. Alright, I got a crazy idea. Just now hear me out. Okay. Like I said, it was a crazy idea. Um Oh, oh snap. Okay. Hey yeah, homie. Who what? Uh, excuse me? Like I hear walking. Oh yeah, you know it's bad when it's all red and shit. Uh, excuse me. Excuse me, sir. Excuse, excuse me, sir. Police officer, I need your assistance. Shit's gone down. It looks like it's going sideways, sir. Sir. Sir, what is? Hey, are you okay? You okay, buddy? Oh God, get him away from me! Get him away from me! Get him! Get him away! We got too close. Let me do something. If you don't fucking let me do something. What the hell? Stop. No, I don't what shoot. the hell. Seriously, what the fuck? Why did shit get so loud all over again? I hope you did now, sir, because I shot you with a lot of bullets. Please don't get up, I'd have to shoot you in the ass. It would be bad, but I'll do it. Y'all see his fucked up face? I knew some shit was going down. It's a bad time to go down, sir. Please stay the fuck down, officer. Fuck off. It's a bad idea. Bad idea. Whatever you got going on here. Hey, hey, um, excuse me? Not what I wanted to do, damn it. Uh. Officer, please remain seated, if you don't mind. Um. Uh, thank you, sir. Let's just, just stay down. What's all that about? Hanging cords and shit. Need you stay there, officer. A lot of dead bodies on this corridor. I don't like it. Um. Excuse me. Need to turn. On the electricity. Yeah, no shit. I tried. Right? I don't actually want to touch him, but you know, sometimes you gotta try and touch people. Except don't don't actually try and touch people, especially if they got signs of the Ebola. Or whatever the fuck that is, because that's not what Ebola does. Look, I don't trust that the cop is still laying over there, so... Like... Like I said, I don't trust that he's still over there and the cop just got up and walked it away, so, um... Apparently we just gotta... <gasps> whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa! What did we find? I found the thing! Um... Oh. Okay, alright, um... I think... Yes. Okay. All right. No. This. Okay. Okay. All right. 
Um, let's see. Okay. Uh, which puts you at definitely needing to go here. Uh, this bit needs to be done like this, I think. Uh, I want to hurry this along very, very fastly because, um, I don't know if you know this or not, but fuck, that can't work. Maybe it can. Maybe it can't. Uh, this is gonna need to be like this, and this is gonna need to be like that. Ta-da! Look, there we go. We got the electric back on, I hope. Where's the fucking cop? I don't trust the fucking cop. Where is he? Fuck, dude, they don't give you shit to go off on with these puzzles and stuff. I don't trust him. Oh, is he? Is he standing out there? <gasps> He's standing out there. We're gonna get in the elevator and get the fuck out of here. Excuse me. Elevator. 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 Yeah, we're on the ninth floor. Fuck that cop. Fuck that cop. I don't actually want to stay this close to these doors either. It'll take a hot minute for it to get over here. Is he going to come through the door? I don't like this. Whatever is about to happen here is not going to be a good thing. And I'm between like a rock and a hard place because I think the cop has just sat out there. I don't know if this is enough room to keep me from getting attacked by whatever is about to come through the door. And I'm pretty sure I'm standing on dead bodies. So... Okay. Well, thank you. Fantastic. Am I gonna trip over that? I hope I don't. Okay. Alright. Well, then, um... Let's, uh... Let's go to eight. Why not? Okay. Alright. Okay. I'm really mildly freaked out about this sh Oh, I should probably not be here. Hey, do you think maybe we shouldn't be here? Look. Guys. Can I go to just the no no floor? Oh man, guys. This is creepy. The puzzles are hard. I don't know what the hell I'm doing. And I can't even say that I'm having fun because I'm creeped out and weirded and I don't understand what's going on here. But, um, I can say that if you kind of like these kind of games, you're more than welcome to try this one out. Can't say it's the worst. Can't say it's the best. It's my first time trying at something like this. So, if you enjoyed what you saw here, why not let me know down in the comments? Oh god, it's a giant fucking door. Is there anything scary on either side? No, we made a- oh! I like ammunition. It's a giant fucking door. Alright. But, if uh, you guys had a good time while you were here, and you enjoyed watching me fumble around trying to figure out uh, padlocks and shoot cops, why not let me know down in the comments? Maybe give me a thumbs up? If you haven't done so already, why not think about subscribing? If you want to see what I'm doing between this and anything else I got going on, you can always check me out on Instagram or Twitter. The handles are popping up there down below. And if you want to see me live in, in person, or as in person as the internet gets, why not come check me out every Tuesday and Thursday over on Twitch from 6 to 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I'm going to go fiddle around with some stuff and maybe try to see if I can get better at this game, and who knows, we might come back to it. So, huh. keep a lookout for all of that stuff, right?